What is up guys? Welcome back to another Instagram tutorial. My name is Steven Womack and today I want to show you how to create that Beyonce Knowles uh, look that she uses for her Instagram pictures lately. It's that blurry vintage look that I tend to do a lot. Uh, in this case it's a really warm tone to it so I will show you how to create this look by using your smartphone, the free Lightroom app and the free app called Snapseed only. Now, before we get started, let me tell you, I've created an amazing presets for you to really upgrade your Instagram game. The link is under this video. Go check them out. It's 27 presets. And if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to my channel and hit that notifications bell because I'm really grateful for that growth that I'm having lately and you guys are responsible for that. So thank you so much. And check me out on Instagram at Stephen Womack if there's anything you need from me any new requests that you have, just DM me. I'm always happy to hear from you. Now I've said enough, let's jump right into that Beyonce Knowles uh, Instagram tutorial. First of all, of course, you will need your smartphone. And then I want you to open up the Lightroom app. And I've chosen this picture of Beyonce as well because it comes super close to that scenery with the white background. And the first thing you wanna do is take care of the lights right here. And we want to, in this case, pull down the contrast to get that vintage analog look to negative 15. The highlights, we want to pull them down all the way to negative 85. The shadows, we want to boost up all the way to plus 33. And the whites, we want to pull down all the way to negative 65. For the blacks, we also want to pull them down just slightly to around negative eight is perfect. Now that's it for the lights. We go over to the colors tab and here we want to add that warm uh, orange temperature. So we boost the temperature up to plus 12 and that does the trick already. We go to the color mix on the upper right, go to the orange tones and here for the skin tones, I want you to pull down the hue to around negative 10. This varies uh, to whatever skin tone that you have. So you might pull it down a little further or a little less. Um, for the saturation as well, we want to pull that down to negative 16. And the luminance, we also want to pull it down all the way to negative 30 right there. So we're done here. We go over to the effects tab and this is where that hazy blurry look comes in. We pull down the texture to negative 36, 35. The clarity, we want to pull down to negative 29. And we also want to pull down the dehaze to around negative 50. So now you already see that it's super hazy. Now to get that really warm color in there, we go to that split toning right here on the upper right. And for the highlights, I want you to drag them to a hue of around to that orange area, let's say around 57 and a saturation of 28. So it's 61, 28. And you can already see how we got that orange tone in there and it looks super close to that Beyonce picture already. So we're down here. We go over to the detail section to, just to smoothen out the colors a little bit. Uh, we make a noise reduction to about 30, 31 and a color noise reduction to 22 right there. So that's it. We're done here. We export the file, save to camera roll, maximum available. And now the next thing you want to do is open up the Snapseed app and choose that picture that we've just edited right here. And now you want to uh, increase that glow a little bit. So we hit the tools tab down here and hit that Glamour Glow tool right in the middle and stay on that first page. And I just want you to increase the glow to maybe even 50 right there. And that's it already with the check mark. We're done here. This is a before and after. And I think we came super close to that real Beyonce Knowles vintage Instagram look, blurry look. And if you really wanna do it the right way, you get a lens filter for your camera that makes that picture blurry already. But since this is a mobile tutorial, I've just showed you how to create this look, or let's say fake the look uh, using your smartphone and the free Lightroom app and the Snapseed app, of course. Um, thank you so much for watching. I hope this was good content. Now, let me tell you again, I've created an amazing preset pack for you with all of my Instagram tutorial filters, presets, 
and a lot of vintage presets. In total, it's 27 presets. Check it out, the link is under this video. And if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to my channel and hit that notifications bell so you don't miss out on any of my future content. And as well, if you have any requests, check me out on Instagram, at Womack. Just DM me if there's anything I can do for you or also just comment under this video. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. See you around. Peace.